Guys, who here is ready for a free Transcendent Scroll? I know you see the screen black that you're like, Bagel, if this is another Amazon Coins promo, it is not another Amazon Coins promo. This is a legitimate event, free Transcendent Scroll to celebrate the seven year anniversary of Summoner's War. First off, it feels like it was just the six year anniversary. Second off, seven years for a mobile game. As much as I crap on consoles, I gotta give them credit. Seven years for any mobile game is quite an accomplishment. So, seven years and two billion dollars later. I wish that was sarcasm. Seven years and two billion dollars later. It's not even, it's not even a joke. Um, we have a seven year anniversary. <laughs> The le they're like, the least we can do after $2 billion is to give you guys all a Transcendent Scroll. So, all you have to basically do, Transcendent Scroll is one of the things that you can purchase from the shop for the 7th anniversary. And I'm sure we're going to see a lot of other 7th year anniversary stuff. It is going to be, 7th year anniversary is in April uh, of this year. So, I'm sure we're going to see a lot of 7th year anniversary stuff around that time as well because remember the six year anniversary they did a lot of different stuff too every anniversary in general they did a lot of stuff but they're seem to be doing more and more and more every year so transcendent scroll is actually a thing that you buy from 100 uh sorry 1000 points from the shop you get points as time progresses over the course of the event the event actually starts soon so let's take a look at everything here uh, seventh, seventh anniversary, April 17th, 2021. Prepared a special uh, event to celebrate. There's two events, actually, we're going to talk about today, not just this one. Uh, log in coins, additional coins during specific days to get various items, including a Transcendent Scroll that sums a default five-star monster. Uh, so it starts December 31st, 7 a.m. Rewards available until June 7th. Um, and then every day, well, we can see this in a second. Uh, how to get seven year coins. You get a thousand of them and you trade in a thousand for a transcendent scroll. Uh, 10 coins will be sent to your inbox every day when you check in. So a thousand divided by 10 is 45. So you only, a thousand divided by 10 is a hundred. So you only have to log in a hundred days to get the transcendent scroll. Um, also you have extra coins that you get from the, D-Day, day minus 10, day minus 30. It's kind of weird how they how they put this, but uh, yeah, like for example, D minus 50. 50 days before the uh, seven year anniversary, on that day you will get an extra 30 coins, uh, 37 year coins, and an extra five mystical scrolls. So it's just a bonus for that specific day. It's not like they up the rewards every time you hit that milestone. Um, so just FYI. Uh, refer to the event page for the seven, remaining days until the 7th anniversary. Um, and then you also have other stuff in the shop, not just the Transcendence. So you have an LD scroll. Uh, the LD scroll is nowhere near as great as a, uh, a Transcendence scroll. Not even the same ballpark. Uh, Devilmon, which is nice. Uh, Super Angelmon, Reappraisal Stone. Uh, two, so you can get two reappraisals. Uh, 15 Mystical Scrolls available, 50 coins each. Guys, don't blow all your coins on other stuff because you're like, well, it's cheap. Let me just get one of these today. Let me just get one of those today. I would recommend to just save them until, I know you guys, it's, uh, saving is hard, but I would recommend to just save them until you get the transcendence, then get the transcendence, and then whatever else you want to get, you get after that. But to just not be like, oh, it's just 50 coins here, 50 coins there every time a mystical scroll is available, because um, then you may not have enough for the transcendence. Um, so anyway, uh, various rewards for collecting coins, 50 coins accumulated, you know, just different amounts of coins accumulated you get. Uh, Devilmon, though, is nice. Uh, 50 ancient coins. I do like those ancient coins, too. So you get 100 ancient coins total from this uh, as well. So that's actually pretty cool. Free transcendence. So that's two free transcendences they give everyone. So everyone gets two Nat 5s for free. One from the Summoner's Way events, and then one from this, uh, from this New Year event. So if you don't have two Nat 5s... That's no, that's nobody's fault but your own, right? Well, yet. Yeah, you're like, Bagel, I didn't get, complete the Summoner's Way. I couldn't beat a hard stage in Labyrinth. I see you there. I see you there. Because there was a decent amount of people that have, that struggle with that part of the uh, Summoner's Way. Anyway, uh, we also have another event, 2021 New Year's Special Events. This is not even going to be the only stuff, though. There's going to be more than this. Um, we have seven days of login. Actually, not that bad. Uh, login to the game for seven days to get rewards. Energy, monostones, 300,000 monostones. Uh, where it says level limit, you just have to be that level or above to get those. For most of us, we are at level cap, so it's not even an issue. So you don't even have to worry about that level limit thing. For new, new, new players... Um, you want to level up, but not too many new, new, new players. I mean, let's be real. Not too many players at, like, level 3 right now. Um, you can get to level 20 in a day. 
in under a day. Uh, so yeah, uh, crystals, 100 crystals, ancient, 50 ancient coins, 5 star rainbow bond, reappraisal, and mystical scroll. Uh, 10 mystical scrolls. You get uh, each one of these every day. Not, not each one of these every day. You get the first one the first day. You get the second one the second. I don't, I don't know why I'm explaining this to you guys. You already know what it is. Uh, you've seen this before. Unless you're new, you've seen this before. Uh, free energy event. Sometimes I glance over these, but I know some people really, really like these, especially if they're very free to play. <laughs> very free to play. There's either free to play or there's not free to play. Especially if they're free to play, they like maximizing resources as much as humanly possible. So it's free energy time, even though I'm not, like, I don't reschedule my life around it. Some people really do appreciate this. Um, so. Uh, and then free energy applied to scenario, Kairos, Rift Dungeon, Rift Raid. What I like to do for free energy event is I like to do whatever the fastest uh, content is that would burn through my energy as much as possible. Like if you, uh, especially those, those free uh, free uh, raids are nice too. So uh, scenario, Kairos Dungeon, all dungeons, Rift Dungeon, Rift Raid. Uh, if you do scenario really fast, I mean, you could do scenario, you stick Tashar in there. Tashar is time to shine, right? Uh, stick Tashar in there, level all your stuff up. Uh, super, super fast uh, for free, right? Free energy. Uh, and then we have Angel Mon Dungeon. Again, something I don't really care too much about, but I know some other people do like this Angel Mon Dungeon. They like to stockpile Angel Mons, especially with the uh, the storage, right? So we have that. Uh, Devil Mon Dungeon. And we get, there's another uh, Rainbow Mon Dungeon too. So we have the first, or the, sorry, the Angel Mon Dungeon. And then there is a Rainbow Mon Dungeon after that. On January 2nd, there is a um, Rainbow Mon Dungeon. So we have Angel Mon Dungeons here uh, for three different days. Then we have Rainbow Mon Dungeon. Then we have Devil Mon Dungeon on January 3rd. This is the only one I care about. The other ones I'll farm if I feel like it. But this one is the one that I care about. Um, and then we have, what is this, Delays. Talking about the Power Up Circle, Holiday Stockings. Um, so yeah, and then we have Double Burning Time Event, which is this XP, uh, XP and Mana. So that's nice. And just talking about all those. Rift Dungeon. Okay, so some more events. Just double acquisition rate for all these different uh, items. Essence drop amounts for the different attribute dungeons. So, I mean, this is just... This is... This is this one specifically is, like, really great for, like, free-to-play players that just like to farm... Get maximum resources as much as possible. And they don't mind scheduling their time around, their, like, students and stuff like that, right? So, anyway, um... Yeah, so nothing wrong with that. For me, personally, I am more excited about this 7th anniversary uh, Transcendent Scroll event. Because this is a Transcendent Scroll. Even though, now that I'm thinking about it, I'm very excited. We get a couple Devil Mons with these uh, as well. But I'm also excited for whatever other 7th anniversary things are going to be happening. So, it looks like they're starting to get the festivities ready 4 months in advance. Which seems crazy, but... They're getting the festivities for- they did it in advance last year, but even, I don't think it was four months. I think it was like two months in advance or something like that. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't remember exactly how long in advance they did, but they were like talking this up like crazy. I'm trying to remember what else they did for the 70th anniversary. There's some good events going on the 70th. Like, these are just the start of it. There's going to be more crazy events going on for the 70th anniversary, not just this. Um, remember the 6th anniversary? There's all those little, um... Like the computer programming kind of thing with like all the sixes and they had like the little teaser trailer spoiler whatever's. Uh, so yeah, I, maybe we'll see some more of those. Maybe we'll see some other big updates for the 7th anniversary. Uh, but at least I just wanted to give you guys, hey, cool. I at least wanted to give you guys uh, the information on that um, while we had it. So anyway, that's it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed it uh, and I will see you as, uh, I hope you guys are excited and I will see you as always in the next one.